So here we go, the brand new Galazzo Show Icon Evolution. Desai is here, 93 rated, a big boost to the pace in the physical, and I mean, a little bit extra on the shooting as well. For cheap and fast FC24 Ultimate Team coins, head over to MMOEXP.com, link down below, and make sure to use my code Morsi at checkout to get yourself 5% off. Now, before we dive into this one, I want to give a shout out to my boy Blue. If it wasn't for him, I would not be able to review this card today. So, Blue, you're a legend, but Marcel Desai is here. Now, probably one of the better options for this really good evolution. It's completely free. You can upgrade a lot of the Galazzo icons. SCN Campbell, for example. And I think for a lot of people, it's between Desai and Campbell. So, I've got Campbell on my main account, which I'm working towards, but we're trying out Desai here. So, let's see if he is the be-all and end-all and the best option. He's 6-1 medium-high, mostly lengthy. 3-star, 4-star. Anticipate and block playstyle plus as well as slide tackle bruiser aerial which is a w relentless ping pass which i like for my center backs and power header and just a phenomenal looking center back the reactions the composure the shooting the long shots could fly you know definitely release a few if you get a chance apart from that finishing if it falls to him in the box he might find the back of the net passing stats aren't great he looks like more of a no-nonsense center back in my opinion but the pace super high same with the defending the aggression the strength this man could be absolutely ruthless. Like, I'm hoping he goes into a tackle, leaves something on the player, comes away with the ball every time. That is my plan. Shadow Chem style is what we've got applied. And look at the state of this team. I'm going to have some fun. Smash the like if you're excited. Let's go. All right. Desai, early doors. You know what, Van der Sar has it. But I'm pretty certain Big Marcel had that covered. But let's go. Game number one in Div Arrivals. Let's clutch up and see just how good a big Marcel is. Oh, he's on the bike with Best. The Kanji's coming across. I think Kanji might make this. Never mind. Not a lot of options for my opponent here, but he does well. In the middle, Marcel Desai switched on. And he's got that power feel. Like, he feels physically dominant at the back. Like, I know when I go in for a tackle with a boy, this man should be coming away with the ball majority of the time. I'm still passing sequence there, you know. I see him bombing forward. One thing I did forget to mention, he can play as a CDM. Wouldn't really recommend it, but... Because he's better as a centre-back. But, I mean, you know, if you've got crazy centre-back options, nothing in the midfield, maybe you should be considering it. Hold up. You know what? That travelled. I don't know why he was on the option for the layoff, but I'm not complaining. I'm definitely going to be pinging those when I get a chance. Because his shot power and long shots are crazy. I slid a second too late. Literally a second too late. If I reacted faster, I would have made the block that I'm sure of it. But Mia Ham absolutely dispatches it in the back of the net. Yes, too easy. It feels so, so insecure, especially when you switch to him in a situation where you've got a jockey. I just feel like I can get involved with the aggression and, aggression and strength but just dominate, reclaim that ball. But we are losing 1-0 at half time. Need to get a goal. There's that goal. It's big Didier Jogba as well. Big boy Marcel. Controlled sprint. I feel a little bit big, a little bit bulky. That kind of puts me off him being a CDM for you. I feel like you just want to utilise the no-nonsense physical aspect and play him as an out-and-out -out centre-back. Back inside. Oh, I don't know how we scored that, you know. A little bit lucky, a little bit lucky. Oh, Marcel, that's it. Big interception. Let's go. Getting sweaty. Marcel. A simple work at the back there. Jude. I like the play. I like the movement. That's it. One more. One more. Leopold. Screen time. We get the lead. Come on. Really want a foot race because that pace boost is huge. This could potentially be it if he plays Mbappe here. That's it. I switched on a little bit too quickly though. I feel like you are pretty much covered if it comes to uh, an out and out race. Because the speed from Desai is not... Yeah, we're not messing about. This sedan, bro. This sedan is on another level. Potential foot race on the cards. Rolfo comes across. He's definitely cutting back though, right? No, he's committing. I'm committing as well. I mean, that is the definition of a no-nonsense centre-back challenge. We have flown into Miaham there. Absolutely decked her. We get a little bit lucky with a rebound, but I love that. Mate, we're just scoring some screamers in this one. Surely that's got to be the rage quit. 
Mbappinho dispatches one top bins as well. One thing I'm noticing is I'm playing against a lot of Desai's. He seems to be in most games and especially the people doing the Evo for him. I wonder if he's untradeable or if they're going out and buying him. Let me know, by the way, if you're watching this debate and doing the evolution. Is that because you've got him in the club already? Or are you going to go splash the cash, pick him up for tradable prices and still do the Evo anyway? Nice. Zico, ping pass there. It is honestly such a nice addition. I might like not really mean a lot, realistically, especially with the lack of uh, passing stats Dessa he has. But if you've got ping pass on your centre backs, it could just help quickly move the ball up the field, especially if you're under pressure, and just kind of like, you know, thread in the pass through little cracks in your opponent's midfield. Didier Drogba doing what Didier Drogba does best right there. Shoot! Oh, can't attack from my opponent. Stay switched on here. Good job through the middle. That's it. We're a little bit behind though. So I thought we're going to catch him. But you never know. You know what? A second or two. I reckon Desley has the speed to get up to Didier there. My man's rushed the shot a little bit. Maybe he felt the pressure of the Frenchman chasing down him. What's Drogba again? Testing jockey speed here. I wonder if he wants a finesse shot. I reckon he does. We're going to go for him. You know what? The challenge. What we chart and stay standing. You're a mile offside there. We'll have that though. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm surprised Bobby tanked that first tackle. I thought we timed that perfectly. But that second slide tackle is literal perfection. It's the art of defending. Go look at Didier in that space. Look at him in that space. It doesn't matter because we're there. Desai raid a pounce makes that uh, interception. Float that. Back stick. Zico makes it two. What a pass. Who whipped that in? Go on, play him over the top. Kanji comes across. Now you pick Jogba in the middle. Go on, give it, give it to him. That's it. We'll have that all day. It's the jockey speed. Like, we feel so fast. Just kind of trying to predict which way my opponent's going to go. Kanji's come round. Oh, do you see the block play style plus in a big man? Marcel flies in front of that one. I will say like centre back play styles. Do you let me know your favourites down below. I'm leaning towards intercept at the moment. But honestly, having a combination across your like two central defenders. Like one with intercept, one with block. It can come in clutch, man. Big Z down as well. This man is an absolute joke. As Mateus blocked my own shot there. Sabotage. Yes. Felt quick, knew exactly where my opponent was going to go there, and then makes the interception with no effort whatsoever, breaking up my opponent's attack. He's an absolute tank, mate. He's a physical machine at the back. Get that. He didn't look favourite. He really didn't. He looked a little bit slow going towards it, but eventually it just looked it's so easy, mate. If you've not tried this Drogba card, like you've got to get, got to give him a go because he's an absolute joke. Yes, there we go. It's just the jockey speed is so fast. His reactions are so high. His composure, beautiful. And then when he goes in for the tackle, he comes away with the ball. Absolutely loving him so far. Like he's got to be up there with some of the best centre backs I've tried in recent weeks. And trust me, there's been a lot that I've reviewed. So where does Marcel Desailly rank in regards to centre backs in the game right now? Pre-team of the season, of course. In case you're watching this after, I think he's got to be super high up there. This man is fast. He's so physically dominant in the challenge. He's six one. He's medium height. Perfect work rates. Mostly lengthy. I like it. Fan of it. And he's just so so quick to jockey with. Like, we don't have the jockey playstyle, but this man moves. He feels so free and so loose. Playstyles are brilliant. Anticipate, block, I like it. Some people might say intercept's the way to go. I, I tend to agree. I do love this for centre-backs, but it's nice to have a variety. So pairing him alongside Nakanji, who's got the long intercept playstyle, is nice, man. And I feel like the pink pass, brilliant going forward. You're going to get heading opportunities for sure. He's got bruiser as well to back up that strength and aggression. This man is not losing a tackle. He goes into it. He's coming away with the ball. And I noticed that in the gameplay. There was one time where Bobby bounced off him. But we'll let Bobby have that because he's a legend of the channel. But yeah, going in for the slide tackles. He's physical. He flies into them. Brilliant card. Composure, reactions. He's got it all. And I reckon I've used Sol Campbell's base version. 
I reckon this man's going to be better than the Sol Cambalibo. I've got a feeling. I think the body type definitely suits this game more. The leaner centre back body type. Sol Campbell is going to feel quick, but I don't think he'll feel as fast as Desai. He's definitely more stockier, and you can see that in game. Still going to be a brilliant option, but I think if you've got Desai and Campbell and tradable, take this man for sure. I am doing the Campbell evil, by the way, on my main account, so I'll get around to trying out the fully evolved version at some point, but... This man's insane, bro. He's insane. Now, would you? Would I say go buy him? I don't know. I feel like you're better off saving your coins. I reckon your best chance here is to just try and pack in. There's so many packs you can open. SBCs, you get them from objectives. Like, you stand a decent chance of getting a card like this. So don't commit to the Evo quite yet if you've got your eyes set on this man. Try your best to pack in because he is absolutely immense. Shout out to my boy Blue again. I hope you enjoyed, guys. Smash a like if you did. And I'll catch you later.